This video explains how to align text labels to a line of a ggplot2 plot in the R programming language. So without too much talk, let's dive into the R code. In this video, I will show you an example, and this example is based on the data frame that we can create with lines two and three of the code. So if you run these lines of code, you can see at the top right of RStudio that a new data set is appearing, which is called data. And if you click on this data frame, a new window is opened, which is showing the structure of our data frame. And as you can see, our data frame contains six rows and two columns, which are called X and Y. And these two columns contain numeric values. Now, if we want to draw these data using the ggplot2 package, we also need to install and load the ggplot2 package, as you can see in lines 5 and 6 of the code. I have installed the package already, so for that reason I'm just going to load it with line 6 of the code. And after running this line of code, we are able to use the functions of the ggplot2 package, such as ggplot and geompoint, as you can see in lines 8 and 9. So if you run these lines of code, you can see at the top right of RStudio that a new blot object is appearing, which is called ggp. And we can draw this blot to the bottom right of RStudio by running line 10 of the code. And then you can see that we have created a scatter blot that contains our six data points of our data frame. You can also see that our scatter plot does not contain any lines yet, and it also doesn't contain any text labels within the plot. So if we want to add a line with aligned text labels to this line, then we can use the geomv line and the annotate functions, as you can see in the next part of the code in lines 12 to 23. So in line 12 of the code, I'm first specifying our plot object that we have created before. And then I'm adding to this the geomv line function. And within this function, I'm specifying at which position of our plot I want to add a vertical line. So in this case, I want to add a vertical line at the x-intercept 3.5. And then I want to annotate a text label, as you can see in lines 14 to 18 of the code. And I'm specifying that I want to annotate this text label at the same x-axis position as our geom v line. And then I'm also specifying the angle of this text label to be equal to 90. And this text label should be right aligned to the text. And for that reason, I'm specifying a backslash n at the end of my text label. In the next step, I also want to add a left aligned text label, as you can see in lines 19 to 23 of the code. So in order to add a left aligned text label, we have to specify the backslash n at the beginning of the text label. So if you run lines 12 to 23 of the code, you can see at the bottom right that our plot is updated. And as you can see, we have added a vertical line at the x-intercept 3.5. And then we have added a right aligned and a left aligned text label to this line. That's all I wanted to explain in this video. In case you want to learn more on this topic, you may check out my homepage, statisticsglobe.com, because on my homepage, I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail. I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video, so you can find it there. If you have liked this video or if you have any questions, let me know in the comments section below. I'll try to respond to all comments as soon as I can. Furthermore, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notified about future video releases. I have already published about 500 videos on this channel and I'm releasing new videos on a daily basis. Thanks a lot for watching. See you in the next video.